So this is van life video two. Just wanted to show you a couple things that I deal with on a regular basis. It's early in the morning. It's cold here in central Oregon. A um, couple things that I've noticed here, let me show you. I mounted my Mr. Buddy heater here up high. Um, if I ever do another van build, I'll find some way to put it closer to the floor. Um, that just seems to give more radiant heat because it's still cold down here, even though it's warm up here on the bed. It's about 27, 28 degrees outside. Um, I'm getting ready to make some coffee. Um, I can't stress this enough. You can't really see it because it's a little dark and I'm trying this other light. Um, but there's my backup solar generator. I use it to run the power and the microwave. I can't overstress, overbuild your your charging system with your solar panels as much as you can. I have two panels which are supposed to be 400 watts and two Renergy batteries. And yet it's with the 2000 watt inverter doesn't, the microwave is seems like it's too much. So the backup solar generator was a must. Um, just little things like that, that I've been encountering in my full-time van life. Um, as you can see, storage is everything. If you're going to live in a van full time, make sure it's a heavier van, half ton or 1500 vans don't seem to have the capacity. So remember you want a 2500 or a 3500 because they do get really heavy by the time you load them up with everything you're gonna need. And I'm kind of a workout nut, so I carry a bunch of workout stuff with me as well. Um, I still gotta build a better curtain there to block out the front, but it does keep some heat back here, which is important. All right, until next time.